Well, this first week of November is National Vocation Awareness Week in the U.S. It's a time to promote vocations and pray for those discerning their calling. Catherine Zeltner introduces us to a woman shattering the stereotype of religious life. If we're doing God's will, it's one of complete joy. Sister Dee Dee Byrne radiates that joy as she gives a tour through her workspace. In fact, what we really need money for is, this is where it all happens, all, the think tank. <laughs> the sleep tank, I mean the think tank. She's a little worker of the Sacred Hearts of Jesus and Mary, a surgeon, and a retired U.S. Army Medical Corps member. In 2009, Sister Dee Dee Byrne retired from the U.S. Army as colonel. She now serves as the director of the Spanish Catholic Center here in D.C. The clinic, run by D.C.'s Catholic Charities, offers medical care to the uninsured. Hello. I'm going to poquito, poquito de lo lo siento. Today, Sister Dee Dee sees a patient who recently had a 17-inch benign tumor removed. Wow. In the OR. Little worker sisters embrace a life of prayer with a wide range of activity. Sister Dee Dee says she serves God with her Georgetown trained medical skills. I go in the operating room and say, Lord, please, I'm doing my best, you do the rest. The sister soldier surgeon travels the world for medical missions from Sudan to Haiti to Iraq. And as long as I can remain little and empty and nothing, he can work more through me than if I'm, ha, 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 look how great I am, because it's really not me, it's, it's God who does it. If you're still discerning your vocation, Sister says, do not be afraid. If you're not called to the religious life, it's okay. You're, you're, you're going to know. He'll make it very clear to you. Catherine Saltner, EWTN News Nightly. Thanks, Catherine, for another inspiring story.